Hey, me, Grandpa. Like what you see? Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe then. Please touch my furs. What's up everyone, it's Halion, and I'm here to show you a quick demo for a game here called Dome Romantic. And I was kind of questioning this game before I downloaded it, but once I gave it a shot, I was like, you know, this is a really neat game, actually. So it is a sort of Steam World Dig meets tower defense roguelike game, basically, is the best way I can describe it uh, as of right now. But well, let's dive into it and I'll show you what I mean here. I'm not going to start with the basic thing. This is just a demo. It looks like I can't even play. Yeah, none of these are available in the demo anyway. It's no big deal. I'm going to play on the normal mode. Uh, also, I got to say, because I haven't really tried anything else. Uh, brutal. Yeah, we're just going to do the normal, I'm going to say again. And we're going to start the run. Let's go. Oh, I just noticed that the dome is a different color than the last time I played. But yeah, we play some kind of researcher or something like that. And we need to gather these materials, bring them back to the base so that we can buy upgrades, basically. So I'm going to quickly do that. And things kind of pick up very quickly. Let's take a look at the upgrades now. So time pauses when I'm here. So the first thing I'm probably going to grab is this. This tells me when the next wave of enemies is going to come, and I need to be here to uh, take care of it, basically. Let's do that. And it doesn't even tell me how many resources I have yet, so... We can buy this, just so it tells me. Which might seem like a bit of a waste, but... Oh, whoops, I accidentally activated our laser. All right, so now you can see in the bottom left, you can see how many resources I have. And you can see the little bar there that tells me when the next enemy phase is coming. Now, astute viewers might be asking, Dan, where's your beautiful face? What's going on, you know? I, this just kind of felt like more of a relaxing game, and there might be more silent bits and stuff like that. I had a run that lasted like 40 minutes. Uh, and I'll probably chop this up if it gets that long or something, but we'll see. Now I have four. I'm watching the enemy bar. You want to go left and right to start, because the further down you go, the more hits your drill takes to actually crack it. I think I just grab these two, and we go back. The more resources you're carrying, the slower you move. But there's lots of upgrades we can get to change that. All right, quickly... And then we get in battle, bring our laser over. Took a couple hits, but that's okay. That little beep at the end indicates that that is the last enemy to defeat. Okay. So we could upgrade our laser. I think I want to do drill strength or move speed, do I think, huh? I'm going to go with drill strength to start. And then I'll do, probably do move speed next. So this way it, it takes fewer hits to drill through the earth here. There's definitely some efficiency things, like I should technically be only drilling two in a row so I know where the resources are. If you played SteamWorld Dig or Terraria, this probably all looks very familiar. Oh, I have enough to upgrade move speed. Let's grab that. It's very atmospheric. I'm kind of excited to see what they come up with later on. This is just the demo, but it still, it actually feels rather like full on, I guess is the way I describe it. Uh, okay, so I have to go down even further. I'm watching the enemy bar, but we're okay for now. Can't really carry that many. I'm only going to carry, I think, three for now. I might just try to come back, grab those two, and then... Uh, call it for there. I'd like to upgrade something defensive now, I think. I hope I have time to do this. Okay, maybe not that much time. How many do you give me? Just give me these two. Let's try to get back quickly. Kind of cut it a little too close probably here. Kind of want to be there for the start. Let's just kill this one first. Because our laser takes a bit to move. Alright, got it. All right, back down we go. It's kind of just a rinse and repeat after that, I'd say. Uh, but it's, the, it's all the different upgrades that they let you pick from and the strategy behind 
when to take that versus something when they take something defensive over something movement based or drill based or something like that, that kind of makes it interesting. So I think now is a good time to probably do. This is uh, how quickly the laser kills something. So I think I'll snag that. We can grab this one too, which just shows how much health our dome has in the bottom left there. And there are ways to repair your dome. That's why I haven't been super worried about taking the hits. Okay. I'm kind of glad that this, uh, I don't know, geologist or space space person has something to do here. Because if I was stuck in this dome in the middle of nowhere, I might, I might, I might go crazy. You know what I mean? I'm glad that they got something to focus on a little bit. I'm sure the attacks don't really feel good though either. Okay, let's see what we got here. Um, I'm thinking laser speed maybe. I don't know. I could try to be more greedy and do the carry strength, which allows me to. Carry more stuff. I'm gonna do that. I think we're okay. Let's see where the enemies are coming from. Got a little lucky here. Oh wow. That's it. Wow. Just a little bit of luck. Alright, we got a different type of resource here. There's a few types. Uh, I think there's three. This one I think I can use to repair the dome as well as some other things. All right, let's start drilling over here. All right, here's an interesting one. It's heavy as all can be, as you can see there. But this will give me sort of a boon in a way, uh, sort of a, a bigger upgrade on its own. It's not really a currency. Pick a gadget. Plant trees that grow fruit, consume the fruit to buff your drill and move speed, and it uses the circular uh, currency. Monster repellent. Install a small bubble onto the dome containing a repelling liquid. Activate to re release the repellent, delaying the arrival of the next wave. Uses circle also. I'm going to go with monster repellent, maybe. All right, let's check out our upgrades again. I think I'll do laser speed now. Pretty standard uh, build, I guess you'd call it. Now let's find out where the monsters are coming from. I guess I should be starting in the center, but we got flying monsters now. They don't have a lot of health, but they deal a lot more damage. Oh, that's not it. Okay, there we go. Out of stuff, let's go. I don't really need to repair the dome that badly now. Alright, we got some circular currencies here. I don't think I really want to spend it on anything right now. I can use it on the monster repellent. You can actually use it on other things here. You can, so I can upgrade the monster repellent, basically, also. And make it more efficient and stuff. Can I use the monster repellent now? I don't know. Doesn't look like I can. I've never actually used it. I wonder if we dig far enough, can we find the Nebuchadnezzar or whatever down here? Back to base we go. Didn't make a lot of progress this uh, turn. Good start to the enemies, though, here. Watching out for the flyers. Got it. Not bad. All right, that's that. Not bad at all. Can I use this yet? Doesn't look like I can. It's still going. Don't. Back down we go to the mine. Working in the coal mine. Going down, down, down. It looks like our monster repellent might be ready. There we go. So it looks like it just stops the bar in the bottom left from going down for a little while. I might as well just use it practically whenever I can. Just keep buying time, right? I think. I hope that's a good strat. The last one here. Back we go. I think uh, next up we really want drill strength. Looks like we're gonna time it perfectly for the next wave of monsters, too. 
Okay, let's snag that drill strength, because it feels like it's taking a very long time now. Okay, let's just center this, see where we need to go. Ah, we got a little boss. Just do whatever I can here, but there's probably more stuff coming. Come on. If I wasn't too greedy with some of these upgrades here. Could be I needed more laser power. Oh no! The scorpion tail! It's coming! There we go, we got it. Not bad. Okay, before I forget, let's go ahead and repair the dome a little. I guess just once for now. Uh, let's go ahead and upgrade the monster repellent too to make it... Hmm. Make it get produced more quickly. No, we'll just make it more efficient for when I use it, I think, for now. Come, my boxes. Come, my boxes. I like it how I'm mining and I just find what looks like little golden treasure chests <laughs> down in whatever planet this might be. I'm just going to use the repellent right away here. Allows me to probably just get one more quick trip back down here. Okay, it looks like we made it pretty much just in time. I only have nine, so I can't get anything that useful out of these. We get move speed again. We might do that. Or maybe, I think I might want to save up for laser power now. Let's prepare our battle stations here. Kind of waiting for to see where this one goes. Okay, I think I'm gonna ignore that one on the right for now. Oh man, that's a lot of mobs. Gonna have to repair a bit after this. Okay, let's do a repair just so I don't forget. I'm gonna do it twice. We have a decent amount of that currency, so I'm not too worried. Okay, there we go. Now we can afford it. I might do move speed for the next one now. Hoping to do just one more quick trip here. Probably not going to use monster repellent this round. Okay. There we go. Anything else I want to upgrade? I could do just overall dome strength. I don't know if I'm that worried about it. I could upgrade the monster repellent, which could be good. Let's go ahead and do that. It'll be a good long-term uh, buy, I'm thinking. Let's center this, see where they start coming from. Good, I might not make it for this. Got it. Quickly. All right, not a terrible round. Let's go ahead and use the monster repellent right away. All right, give me something good here. We got the orchard for the buffs for the circles, but I'm already spending the circle currency on the monster repellent. It's all shield that will absorb some damage recharges automatically. All right, that sounds pretty good. Uh, it installs a little thing like right underneath. It's kind of cute. Monster repellent's already back. That was really fast. I'm going to go ahead and grab more move speed. And I think I'm going to use the monster repellent again. It's just giving me so much more time here. And I still have plenty of the currency I need for, to use it, so I'm not really that worried about it. Okay, I don't think there's anything I want to buy first, really. Oh, I probably should have repaired. I think I can still repair in the middle, though. I think you shoot more slowly if you're holding down the laser, so... Oh. You don't want to do that. I don't think I'm going to be able to get to this flyer before it moves. Okay. 
Okay, there we go. Let's get the repairs before I forget again. I think I go for laser speed next, I'm gonna say. Laser speed kind of sounds good. There's also like max health on the dome. I'm not seeing the recharge on this. I don't see the shield, rather. As you can see, the further down you get, the wider actually the whole area becomes, too. So it gets, it doesn't just get deeper. Things get wider by quite a bit as the further and further you get down. So you get further and further away very quickly. I don't know if I really have time to go back down there now. Let's get laser speed. And I have six. Or anything else I can do like very quickly. I'm gonna drill down the center a tiny bit. Back we go. It was probably pointless for me to try to do that. Maybe I should do dome uh, uh, max health here. What else you got here? Could do. Uh, oh, this is the shield stuff. That's right. I could charge up the shield. That might be better. Requires uh, circles, which is a little concerning since I'm trying to do a lot of monster repellent. Okay, luckily I'm like right here, so it didn't matter that much. Okay. Okay, not bad at all. Let me see. I'm gonna want to use that monster repellent soon. Upgrading the shields cost the circular materials, but uh, I don't need to uh, just to use the shield. I don't need it. Looks like we got another uh, gadget here, so that's good. Okay, what do we got here? We got install a laser that stuns small monsters automatically, slowly produces circles through condensation. I've tried the stun laser, it's not bad, but I think I'm worried about circle production. So I think we'll just use that. Use some monster repellent there too. Back down we go into the pit. All right, another, another battle. Oh, uh, this is a new enemy. Ooh, it kind of tells you where it's coming from, but it moves incredibly fast. You didn't get to see it, thankfully, because if you see it, you're probably too late. It's like a kind of a missile that just comes right at you, and you just gotta aim from the direction of whatever that junk is, basically. Now, I might skip the square material here, because that, that's just to repair uh, the dome, and I don't need any of that right now, so I'll get it when I need it, but I got six, and I don't really have any dome to repair, so kind of no point. Ah, we got another gadget right here. All right, what do we got here? We got pros pros prospection meter. A meter showing the distance to the nearest resources will also show directions with upgrades. Ooh, not bad. Maybe I'll do that. I've never had that one. Let's use that. So where's the meter? Oh, it, it's next to the resource, I see. So it's showing that I'm getting close. There's some. All right, I just healed the dome up to full just in case. I don't know, maybe we'll have a bad turn or something like that. I'm thinking, let's see, there's the prospect meter. I don't know about upgrading that. Let's place a direction of the closest. Ah, iron compass could be good. I think so, you'll kind of just find it all naturally eventually. So I don't know if I really care about upgrading this that much. Uh, now, hmm. I'm out of a lot of the resources that I need. I don't even have any, uh, the circle stuff. All right, well, it's a battle we go either way. 
What do you got for us? Got some bosses here. Come on. This is gonna get spicy. I'm gonna try to kill this one first. One. It's like we're taking some damage here. Oof. It's kind of a rough run there. Oh no, the time. Oh no. I got lost. <laughs> I. I got lost in thought there. Run, 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 run. I'm coming. I also need to repair. Oh no. Let's do max health then too, since I kind of messed this up. Oh my God. So many. All right, I got one before I got here. Oh, I can't even shoot it. Oh, this is getting really hard now. I got two drills on the left, it looks. I don't know which one I'm hitting, but... Looks like it will survive, but not by a whole lot. <laughs> I think I'll survive. Ooh, that was close. Okay. Need to repair a lot. What does this do? Permanently increase the structural strength of your dome. No. I have to use all of that. We definitely need something. I need more laser power, I think. Maybe I can get the 20, but it's kind of unlikely also. I got the shield stuff here. Okay, can't use the monster repellent yet. Need more circles. All right, let's take a look. I think I upgrade the shields. Uh, it means I can't repair if I do that though. <clears throat> Recharge speed can also happen. Could do that. Hmm, I can only do one though. Oh boy. Kind of want to repair. Let's do that. And we'll repair like once. I think. One more time. Alright, and prepare ourselves for potentially the last battle here. Come on. Ah, oh, crap. I thought I finished it. I did not. I don't think I'm going to make it to the sink before it moves. Oh, I did? Wow. Become the Big East, probably. No, that was it? Oh, I guess we got an e I guess we kind of had a boss wave, and now they kind of toned it down a little bit. Okay, okay. Then I feel like we I have a better chance now then. My dr drill strength is severely lacking. You can see how many taps it takes to break these blocks right now, so things have definitely slowed down a lot. Looks like I'm finding my way. No, what happened? Oh, no, no, no. I tried to grab the circle at the same time and I just dropped everything. Oh, no. What's the drill cost? Cost 12? I think I'll have that soon, at least. Oh, no. How far down do these things drop? Oh, my God. I tried to be slick. I tried to be fast. Ooh. It's getting a little nerve-wracking, though. Let's just do it now. I'll also repair the dome a tiny bit. All right, and prepare for battle. Zap them. Oh, here comes one of those things. Got it. 
easy. Oh wow, that was a really easy phase there then. So I guess you kind of had these break points where if you get past like a, a harder phase and then you get a break for a while. Okay, okay, okay. This game might go on for quite a bit longer than I expected then. All right, all right. I'm going to bring these back. Barely going to make it in time, if at all. Uh, I'll have 14, and then I think I'm going to save up for the 20 laser power after that. Okay. Getting some big guys now. I guess I need to stop so I can go over here. Start firing at this one instead now, I think. It's hard to know, like, what to prioritize here. A bit. Oh no! This looks bad! Looks incredibly bad. Alright, got rid of one. Alright, finally got rid of one of the ranged. Can't seem to hit the other range right now. I still can't hit the other range. Crap! I think this is the end. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, dome over. I messed it up. I could have stopped and repaired too. Oh, but that's dome romantic. Kind of a cute little game. And that's just the demo, like I said, but I get the urge. It is kind of slower paced. It's a bit more relaxing. It kind of takes a while. And as far as I can tell, there's no way to like really speed up the runs, but it's still kind of a nice experience as it is. But let me know in the comments what you guys think. Uh, definitely a unique game, uh, at least in terms of the genre, you know, they, kind of a spin on some other things. But all right, like, comment, subscribe, you guys know the deal, and I'll see you later. Bye-bye now. Pardon me, could I have a meowment of your time, YouTube? It's me, Grandpa, Halion's beloved kitty cat wonder. If you love this hysterical content, pitter-patter your way over to twitch.tv forward slash Halion, where we stream every Sunday, Monday, Wednesday and Friday at 12pm Eastern. I loaf you. Nyah.